I am going to continue tracking here what we can expect for the rest of this week into the weekend. But we're going to be joined by ABC 17 Storm Track meteorologist John Ross, who's going to be taking a look at how things might change in this forecast. We're looking very closely at the path of this storm, and he's going to explain what might be behind some of those changes. Yeah, Jess, you said that, and it's exactly right. As we get closer to seeing impacts from this storm, confidence, as you mentioned, is increasing on what those impacts could be. But still, certain details in the forecast may change that could have a big impact on what we see later this week. With a winter storm approaching by midweek, the Storm Track weather team has its full attention on tweaking the forecast. There are three key variables that still play a role in the remaining uncertainty surrounding the storm, track, intensity, and transition time. First, let's look at the big picture. Our primary disturbance is an upper level low to our southwest. At the same time, a disturbance from the north is expected to advance southeast. If these two disturbances can sync up, it may create a stronger storm that would have a more northern track. If our storm tracks further north, this brings more warmth into mid-Missouri. This would also favor less snow, more rain, and even more freezing rain. Storm track will likely have a big impact on onset timing, but we will likely all see a changeover to wintry mix and snow at some point. Currently, timing slates rain for Wednesday evening, changing over to a wintry mix Wednesday night into Thursday morning, but a slow cool down could greatly affect impacts. If cold air is slow to rush in, road temperatures will take longer to cool below freezing, greatly impacting any wintry precipitation precipitation totals they otherwise might see. Overall, confidence is increasing in the forecast, but stay tuned as any of these variables could have a sizable impact on what we end up with on Thursday. Reporting for the Insider, I'm ABC 17 Storm Track meteorologist John Ross.